All right, we are back on our druid in Diablo 4 with our summoned werewolves. And our bag is an absolute mess right now. Let's clean some of this up, and then we are going to continue with the story and see what happens. Uh, where is the... the spirit born have always been where powerful Where is and the mysterious. blacksmith in this town? There are so many walks. towns in this game. Finally. Uh, all right, salvage the jungle. Masterwork to okay. Parts. And what do we got here? Let's see. Uh, basic attacks gain attack speed. Uh... All right, so I think I had just replaced this. So I need to get rid of that. And I need to put basic attacks, gain attack speed on this thing. So I need an occultist to be able to move that. Does this town have an occultist? It does not. Okay, so I need a town that has one of those. Uh, where's a town with those services? I mean, that, that, that's the capital. All right, that definitely has one. All right, so I'm going to go over there. I need to visit an occultist to put this unique effect on my uh, my new ring. Cleaning bags, who are you and what have you done with my clock? <laughs> my bags are full. Blue, look, my whole th I do clean my bags. My whole thing is I don't let them get full. But you guys want me to clean them when they're like, there's like only 50 slots filled. And it's like, I paid for 500 slots. I'm going to use them all. You know? You, you guys are just unreasonable. Um... Where is the... Where's the occultist? Oh, uh, okay, I went right past it. It's right over here somewhere. Whoa, a little lag spike there. Be good to me today, my little war machine. All right, let's see. Uh, increase damage cast of Wolf Companions. Forces over power. Uh, blood Howl. Mm. Blood Howl increases crit strike. By how much? Or, or for, for how long, I mean. Uh, rapid aspect. Okay, I think that was it. Oh my god, 97,000 gold. Good lord. Okay. And... Alright, so there we go. Uh, that has been restored to how we need it. Okay. This... We can use this. It's more damage, so like, for example, let's see, this does, how much damage does this do? This does 851 damage. If I equip this, it does 844. Why is it less? I guess because this has willpower on it. All right, so I guess we don't we, we don't equip that. Uh, get rid of that. And get rid of that, okay. And now, and those are not salvageable. All right, so I just need to get rid of this stuff and then we're done with all this. Who is that? Arrow Lozen, hello! Welcome, Errol. Errol, we just did keep talking and nobody explodes for two hours with flute. She killed me many, many times. I can come back Maybe we could do a uh, collab sometime. We talked about it in the past, but we just never got around to doing it. But we could do a collab sometime where uh, one of us is disarming the bomb and the other has the manual. We just need to make sure if we're gonna do that, that uh, the viewers can see can see both, but the, the streamers can't see both something. All right, we're just gonna toss that because apparently I can't salvage it. Actually, wait, I think I could vendor it. I haven't like vendored anything. Hold on a sec. Where's the? That's a stash. Uh, how do I sell? I do not know how to sell stuff to the vendor. Huh. Let's see. Father, bring you luck. No, this is like gambling. I do not know how to sell things to the vendor. Why is it not right click or just drag things over? Don't be afraid to DM at me about it, it could be fun. Oh, heck yeah. I think uh, it's just gonna be like scheduling. What's going on? Oh, new quest? Seeps from the earth, tainting all that it touches. Great hulking demons follow in its wake, bearing portals to the fiendish realms. This is not the wanton chaos of a triune. This is intimate. Intimate, oh! This is hatred seething in the veins of the land. Mephisto's vile corruption has returned. We, Zakarum, are few. But we shall fight this creeping evil to our last. Will you help us? Mm, show me my standing with Zakarum remnants. 
Realm walkers spread Mephisto's hatred throughout the land. Slay them to open a seething realm. Delve into the portal and complete the dungeon to earn seething opals. Consume a seething opal for a bonus to experience gain and treasure drops and activities. Earn favor with Zacharum remnants by battling realm walkers, slaying monsters in seething realms, or slaying monsters anywhere with a seething opal effect. Okay. Alright. Alright, where is the main quest? It's over here. Um, looks like if I teleport there, that's going to be closest. Wednesdays are my best days, so that sort of thing. I'll remind you in your HL. Roger that. Roger that. Dude, it was, uh... <laughs> it was pretty crazy. It was pretty crazy. There were times I was like, Flute, well, why do I cut? She's like, I don't know. And I'm like, dang it, Flute, how hard this could be? How hard could this be? And I would open, like, the manual, like, after I'd already lost the game. I'd open the manual to see what she was looking at, and she had this whole freaking, like, Venn diagram. And I was just like, oh, never mind. This looks kind of complicated. <laughs> Yeah, I guarantee you, chat, if we, uh, if I traded, uh, jobs with Flute Girl, we would be back to, like, level one, because, like, we would both be having to learn completely different skills. No, no, no. I'm getting some weird lag spikes in this. Hopefully it passes. Someone said, really enjoying my Necro this season. I, I think Necro is probably still my favorite in this game. Uh, I picked Druid just to do something different, because chat uh, has told me before they don't like seeing me play the exact same thing every single time. So I was like, all right, I beat D4 um, base game with Necro, so I'll do Druid this time. And it's all right, but uh, I think I liked the Necro more. You can play uh, the game with more than two people. Yeah, 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 you can have two people yelling at you. Uh, Eru, I'm sorry about Abalon. Don't be. He was sick. You gave him a gift. Mercy. I didn't have it in me to do that for him. So, thank you. Now, tell me. This is do fine. Do you think you can do it again? This is all fine. What? I mean... Nerel. You really think she's been lost? No. Never saw the point of despair. But we'd be fools not to consider all the cards. She might still be fighting. She might not. Either way, she'll still need you. Focus on that, my friend. Come what may, you'll be there for her. I must wait a moment. Okay. Uh, let's see, this way. How are you liking leveling with the druid? Uh, after playing Necro, it feels very slow. But it's all right. Nairel and I have eagerly awaited you, Wanderer. I'm low on spirit. of hate. Search the Durance of Hate for Nayrel with Arrow. Hang on, chat. We got a visitor. How's it going, dude? Have you come to battle the forces of evil as well? Do you want your chair? Ah, oh, he did. He wanted me to pull the chair over so he could hang out. Is that better? Alright. Now he's in the co-pilot seat. Alright. to 
before is blocked. Yes, it is. So this way is blocked as well. It's gotten worse in here. Oh, Akarat's back. You've done well to come this far. He's still here. A good sign Erel is still holding on. Suddenly almost dead. Do you like mini builds that much, or are you just being somewhat lazy? Uh, wait, what? I'm pressing buttons. If I wanted to be full lazy, I think I'd, I'd play the necro, but I'm breaking the mold with you. But no, I, I really do enjoy uh, minion mechanics. I will say these minions, even though I've already got some massive bonuses to them, feel much worse than the necro ones. For example, just just a minute ago, we had a cutscene where we were talking, and my minions were fighting some nearby small mobs during like a thirty-second-long conversation, and the minions did not kill those mobs during that conversation. During for like thirty seconds, they were wailing on them and weren't winning. Like the druid ones just do not feel that great. Like most of my damage is coming from active skills right now. I must wait a moment. Do not have enough spirit. I need more spirit. Seems they depend a lot on their active abilities. Oh yeah, they're like mostly their active abilities. Feels like the passive damage they do is very negligible. Like my hardest hitting skill is when I run into a group of mobs and then do the poison creepers active, uh, which just does a lot of AOE damage and immobilizes like everything around me. I like the idea of having a personal self-sustained army, which is why I like minion builds. Uh, yeah, that's, I, I would say Necro is definitely better for that than the Druid. Like, the Druid wolves, you can't even heal, so like eventually they die, and then you go without them for a while, and then they eventually respawn. But you cannot like restore their health in any, in any meaningful fashion. It's like during a long boss fight, your wolves might die like 30 times. I'm not ready yet. Uh, 
Buck, are you enjoying D4 so far? Uh, yeah, it's it's fine. She was here before. I'm mainly Where's here to gone? see where the story's gonna go, because I've been playing the Diablo story since I was like 10 years old or something around that. So I'm very curious to see what they do with it. Gone with a wave of the paw. A miracle maker, just like the old myths say. Or the doctrine, if you ask the Zakharun. To tell you the truth, it wasn't by coincidence that I found your body floating down the river. It was him who sent me to you. I'm out of spirits. Time. All right, chat. I'm gonna back up over here for a second. You guys keep it on me, keep me safe. I'm gonna tell the boy good night. I'll be right back. Uh, done with me. He's telling Chip goodnight now. PM3K, thank you for the prime, buddy. I appreciate that. Welcome. have a force minion target button. Not that I know of. I was really wishing for that before. Like Grim Dawn and Last Epoch, you could do that from level one. I don't know that this game has that. Mm, on that note, we do have two alternate advancement points to spend. Hmm... the free lightning. So this one's like every something seconds. So you can get up to every eight seconds a free lightning bolt hits an enemy nearby for 67 damage. However, these right now are every, what is it? Every five seconds, each of four ravens do 140 damage to something on screen. <laughs> it's just, because uh, I've got a piece of gear that's like drastically increasing the damage of summons, this is just so much better. 
Let's see, this, uh, 50, 14. I think just because of what we currently have, the biggest damage increase is going to be the Ravens. So I'll, uh, I'll cap those out next. Never thought I'd have the personal help of Akrat himself. Or, rather, his spirit. Though I suppose mythical help is needed to face mythical evil. What did Mephisto tell you, anyway, back in the fields? He actually thought he could convince me to let him out of the stone. Hell, he's done enough damage from inside it. Spirit of Akira. Why are you helping us? Spoken so freely. It is beautiful to wander free of shame. I help you to help Nerel. The Hantu depends on her. <sighs> Say it plain, Eru. An honest question for an honest answer. It was she who brought the prime evil here to begin with. She who drew the hollows. The stone woke the hollows. But Mephisto planted them centuries ago. They were here when I still walked as a mortal. When I first fought and scarred the wolf. Long before the fall of Kurast. The stone is bound to her soul. I don't know the history of Akarat. I didn't know he used to be mortal. Be put to rest. Saving her soul will save all of us. Go. She needs you. Now. Uh, for mini builds, I prefer having one big minion than several. Um, the closest I can think of that is the Bone Golem from Necro. But you're still going to get several. The one who heals corruption from the Light Lost Land. The one who carved from Akarot's Light our Holy Order of the Zakaroon. The one who charted a holy pilgrimage from Akarot's light filled steps. The one who bore the torch of light to the world's unknown. The one who rose from the groups of evil to let forth her inner light. The one who wrote the words of Akarot for all sanctuary to hear. consumable potions do you have anything that's really good overpower damage crit strike increase max life and xp gain let's use one of those eru give me the heart I couldn't get the Guardian's blessing, but 
we think consuming its heart will free you. She's supposed to just eat it raw? You ask me if anything I do matters. I've been thinking about what I said. That with good allies, the weight of our burdens gets easier. Nerel. It's me. I'm here for you. I will say that thing's about the size of her head. We're gonna be here for a while. She has to get all of that into her stomach. Last time, that was the uh, heart of a heavenly being that we were going to just ask it for its help, but then it started getting corrupted and we had to fight it. And so the backup plan was bringing its holy heart to her. Didn't know she was going to eat it though. Gives you telekinesis. Yo, this woman has been to the ringer. Someone prepare like a friggin' hot sauna for her to relax in. <laughs> oh, wait, he's gonna give her a ride? Where are they going? They're already in Trevincal. I thought this is where they were going to try to cage Mephisto. I honestly don't know where it's taking her, unless they're just leaving. Isn't Druid one of the weaker classes? I'm not sure. I, I didn't check the meta or anything. I just wanted to try it. Uh, level 46, plus one skill point. Uh, let's do that. Okay. Escape the Durance of Hate. So, it totally might be. But, I don't know. Uh, so I guess I just gave her a ride outside. Good to see you alive, I friend. I words rehearsed in case you or Lorath ever tracked me down. All I can say now is... I'm really happy to see you too. You did good in there. I had help. Thank you for that. Uh. I'm Eru. But don't thank me. Thank the spirit whose heart I carved out for you. It was a gamble and a half. But you made it worth it. You saddled the stallion. You're back on top of the stone. Now I have to ask.